Okay, hi everyone. My name is Matt Hudson from CSI and today I'm going to show you PTC co-create modeling's configurations. Now configurations are really great um, for making quick design changes and making quick um, changes to 3D models. Okay, so what I'm quickly going to demonstrate is the fact that I've been just been sent this gearbox, you know, I'm an engineer and I've just got to quickly make a change to one of the gear components inside. Now as you can see, this is a fairly large um, assembly and as you can see by the structure browser there's lots of parts in there and we've also got many sub assemblies as well with loads of stuff going on so it, sometimes it can get a bit confusing alright so what I need to do is I need to get inside here and have a look well thankfully I've got some fi configurations that are already set up so I can just quickly step through like so and then I can eventually get to my part and, uh, and here I've got the exploded one now what I need to do is I just need to quick make a quick design change to this part here it's just a nice simple design change to this um, hole, this milled hole and I need to change the radius to 4 to match this one here as well okay because these holes are going to be filled in um, when it comes to the manufacturing and then that's done and fine so a nice quick design change done there and that can now be sent off to say my head engineer and that can be um, ticked off and that's ready to go and be made now it doesn't look like much there but it, I've saved so much time with a configuration instead of having to go through you know the top assembly level and have a look okay so right what do I need to go through um, you know wh which which assembly am I looking in is it this assembly here or this part here you know it just saves so much more time because I've got these configurations and they're really really great and as you can see you can just jump straight through to it okay I'm also going to demonstrate on here just this gear assembly let me just turn that off there now I can demonstrate here within this that I can I can see that there this is a dis disengaged um, gear and this is an, an engaged gear nice and simple and just using configurations like that and also I've got an exploded one of just this um, gearbox here so that's just showing you that you can also put them in sub assemblies they don't have to be at a top level assembly as well you know you can put them on a part and they're basically just temporary views temporary views to work in to show other people for understanding or you know just for demonstration purposes however you want to use them they're just a really 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 great tool okay so I'm just going to quickly jump back and now I'm just going to show you how to um how to make a quick configuration okay so first of all let me just deactivate that one that we had active there I just jump up to my create configuration button here select an owner which I'm going to put as the top assembly okay and then I'm just going to call it demo config like so okay so we've got it highlighted there now what I want to do is just jump to this view here and view it by face okay let me zoom out and then I'm going to position this part here right okay and then I'm going to position this part as well and they're done and then I'm just going to quickly get rid of that get rid of get rid of those and that and that there like so okay just those there as well now I'm going to capture that camera and draw list what that's basically saying when I do that is it's capturing that camera view and anything that's turned on or off in the structure browser so anything that's turned on will basically be captured anything that's turned off won't be captured okay so this is why you get the um, exploded views and you get say just the gear views and things like this so we're going to jump back here so I've just been sent this now I, you know, I, I want to jump into my config that I've just been made which is like so to get that view there and now I can work from this view you know if I need to for work from this elevation okay alright well thank you very much guys that's just a quick demo on configurations and um, take care